more will come and one will sprout more ants sees it. It's pathetic. Just a dream. The past and the present are two ends of the same rope. They are only apart because the dream is alive. Otherwise, the future will be broken down and thrown into the arms of the past. And the past, instead of remaining a vague and smoky waiting point, could be turned into a meaningful, well-defined point. Death. Death? Yes, death. Dying. That is the greatest happiness. Who knows how many have become happy just by dying? They have got all of the future in the mold of the past. And that is why they are happy. I too must die one day. Then why not right now? Don't say that. Live. Live now. One needs faith to this. Faith in God. Faith in fortune. Faith in man. Faith in work. Faith in revolution. Faith in oneself. Faith in love. Tell me, which of those is alive in me today? Not faith in life. Life. <coughs> Engaging in petty <coughs> trivialities when one can't answer the most important question of all. What meaningless poses and lies for which there is no real need. No real need. Yet, one has to live. That's life. Man's life. The lie in my life is the lie in the lives of many. What do you want to do? What shall I do? Shall I go to sleep? Or shall I laugh it off? Maybe that's better. Life is so farcical that there's no use hiding one's laughter away. <laughs>